Hey everyone, it's Jenny, and today I have a review video for you from the brand Love a Beauty and Planet. Um, I'll link my unboxing video I did a few weeks ago. Um, I did get these products for free through CrowdTap, which, like I said, anybody can sign up for CrowdTap. It's completely free. Um, and then sometimes they send you um, sample shares, um, and then that way you can try some new products. Um, this is a new brand. I know at Walmart I did see a display for the Love Beauty and Planet. Um, I think it was around $6.94. I kind of browsed online. I think Target had it for like $6.99. If you can get it at Amazon, I think Walgreens, probably most drugstores. Um, but I'll definitely link the uh, Love Beauty and Planet website below because it tells you more about their collections. And then um, I'll try to link... Um, the the products that I mentioned um also in the description box below too so uh let's get into they sent me three different um items from the Love Beauty and Planet brand um I'm gonna have to say loved this brand loved it um it's um it's supposed to be natural vegan even the bottles itself are made um from recycled material which I you know I'm like you know they're really taking an initiative um the the love beauty implant is from um Unilever I think is the the company brand um so um the first product I'm gonna talk about is the um coconut oil and I think it's yang yang lang lang oil I'm not sure uh hope and repair three in one benefit Benefit oil, recovery for damaged hair, and acts uh, of love for our planet. So that's what it looks like. I know I've got my ring light on, so I'm trying not to blind you, but it's what it looks like. I should also mention I did take some notes um, that there are, I think, six different collections. Um, the uh, coconut oil and yang yang oil. Uh, the Marumur Butter and Rose, Tea Tree Oil and Vetiver, Argon Oil and Lavender, um, Coconut Water and Mimosa Flower, and then Shea Butter and Sandalwood. I actually got to try three products from three of the different collections. This is great. Um, I actually use this as a, um, like a pre-treatment uh, before I wash my hair. Not really a treatment, but like an oil before I wash my hair. And I noticed when I did that my hair when it was wet it was easier to comb um so i appreciate that um you can also use this to if your hair's a little bit dry and you need that little bit of you know moisture back into it it's really great for that you know put on the ends of your hair so this was really good i was surprised i liked it because i'm not usually a fan of hair oils but when it said to use it as like a pre uh pre-wash before you shampoo your hair i was like i'm gonna have to try that and I really, really liked it. Um, next up is the Maru, Maru, Maru Butter and Rose. This is the Bountiful Body Wash. And that's what she looks like. And I appreciate so much on a body wash that this has a pump. Um, even on my lotions, I like that it has a pump. I, I, is anybody else like that? Like, I, I appreciate the pump. <laughs> and, um... It's made with organic coconut oil, uh, maru maru butter, ethically sourced rose, plant-based cleansers, mild cleansers, vegan, not tested on animals, no sulfate, no parabens, no dyes, no guilt. So I always it basically tells you everything that's in here. Um, now some rose scented products um, can be too much for me. They can really aggravate um, a migraine or bring one on. But this is a nice rose scent. Um, now it's not com it's not completely fragrance free, but it's a nice rose with the almost um, like soap smell, like um, almost want to try to think of a, a just like you know a mild soap, but with a little bit of rose fragrance to it, which I thought was really really nice. Because at first I was like, if this is too rosy, I'm not gonna like it. And I do have to say, I think the packaging is really pretty too. It's got the little you know rose designs it's got a pump which i loved um it smells really good it lathers up amazingly which i love a good lather in my body washes and shower gels um 
really really like this i shaped my legs with it worked great um very moisturizing and um, this is the bountiful moisture for lush moisture and acts of love for our planet they always put for acts of love for our planet um on the packaging too which i think is cute and you know you can definitely repurpose uh these bottles i forgot to mention on the oil it does have a pump as well which is really nice you just use i usually use two pumps put on the ends of my hair and went to wash it and it worked great next up is um the shampoo and this is shea butter and sandalwood purposeful hydration it's a hydrating shampoo they do have um in the hair care line of course they have the oil and uh, they have shampoo they also have conditioner dry shampoo leave-in conditioner and hair mask um, so they do have you know multiple products um this was really really good the smell of this i can just smell it right now it's almost got like a vanilla fragrance to it which it smells so good uh shea butter and sandalwood must be the shea butter that i'm smelling that's reminding me of the vanilla but it's like i could just keep smelling this that's that's how good this it reminds me of something from Bath and Body Works too, and I can't quite remember what product it is, but it smells so yummy. Um, hydrating shampoo, really, really loved it. Sometimes my hair does get dry. Um, I wish I had the matching conditioner um, with this to see how well I'd like it, because I have a feeling I would love it. So I may actually purchase the conditioner, and um, that way I can have the matching set, because I kind of like to match my shampoos and conditioners. Um, uh, pampering moisture for dry hair and acts of love for our planet so super cute and um, my favorite product is probably the body wash which surprised me the most because like I said I was kind of leery of the rose but it like I said it's a light rose fragrance shampoo is also really really great and surprisingly love the hair oil so if you like uh, more natural products um, I would definitely give this a try to see if you like it um, I would definitely love to you know the other collections because I've smelled the maroon mirror butter and rose um, the teacher oil and vetiver I'm not too sure about I'm kind of leery a teacher oil because I think that kind of irritates my skin and um, there's the argon oil and lavender which I would like to try and of course the coconut and Lang Lang oil and coconut water and mimosa flower. I bet that's really good too. So let me know if you've tried um, any of these products. Did you like it? Um, I'm, I'm a huge fan. So I was really glad that CrowdTap sent those um, to me to try, which was awesome. Um, so let me know. I'd love to know if you've tried this, if you've tried any other um, fragrances, any other products. I'd love to know. So leave it in the comments below. And um, please let me know that you like this video by giving it a thumbs up. Um, I'm starting to really like doing these review videos. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Love to have you here. And have a fabulous day. Bye.